Hi everybody, Honest John here. Uh, the latest lie and conspiracy theory being spread by Fox News and the right-wing uh, noise machine is that the mainstream media are not covering the trial of Ghislaine Maxwell. Uh, some are even saying that the media has been banned from the courtroom. This is not true. The fact is that the media has complete access to the trial, although there are some documents that uh, the judge has sealed for now. And almost every day there are media reports about it. But of course the people at Fox News and the right wing noise factory know that their listeners will never fact check them. All they would have to do is tune into CNN or uh, any mainstream media outlet for an hour to hear reports about the trial. Or they could pick up a newspaper, but of course they're too stupid to read. So what is the purpose of this easily disprovable lie? Well, to put it simply, it's a cover-up. The right-wing media wants to give the impression that they are covering the trial, in fact that they are the only ones covering the trial, without actually doing it. And the reason for this is that Donald Trump's name has already been brought up by several witnesses at the trial. And you're certainly not going to hear about that on Fox News or any other right-wing media outlet. The fact that our former pedophile in chief was a regular guest at Jeffrey Epstein's parties and that Trump has been credibly accused of raping a 13 year old girl at one of those parties is not a discussion that these right wing media outlets are going to allow. And you're not going to hear about Trump's description of Epstein as a fun guy. Or the fact that Trump talked about having sex with his daughter Ivanka since she was 12 years old. One time during an interview, Trump was asked what he and Ivanka had in common, and he answered with one word, sex. And when Trump owned the junior Miss Beauty pageant, it was common knowledge that Trump would frequently barge into the young girl's dressing room hoping to get a look at these children's naked bodies. But you're not going to hear about that from the right-wing blogosphere, are you? Because they're not just covering up for Trump. They're covering up their own sexual perversion that they share with him. Thanks for listening.